Oh, what? You thought we were done with this already? No, we're swooning Jerry this time. I'm just gonna keep doing the mini games for now, just because I, I don't really care. Um, oh, I, uh, I work at the bank. I collect discarded rubber duckies, you know? You're a big fan of ducks, aren't you? Jerry the human duck? Or the duck man? Anyways. Um, what do I do for fun? Oh, I nurse ducks, of course. I'm a big fan of ducks, as you can see by the fact that I'm on this date in the first place. Do I like traveling? Oh, yes, I actually migrate habitually. Uh, is, is a man or woman who was murdered with over 100 people has murdered over 100 people a bad person? <laughs> if they're not duck people, it's A-OK. -okay. Wait, wait, is a man or woman who has murdered with over a hundred people a bad person? Oh, okay, I think he means like grouped? I don't know. Um, no, it's much easier to get into- what? Sure, okay, not the best- whatever. To date someone who's uncomfortably obsessed with fantasy novels, I am uncomfortably obsessed with fantasy novels, so absolutely. You have my plus one sort of virginity. As long as the evil race is in no way related to ducks. There we go. That's the right answer, you know. I'm very good at choosing between three terrible options. Would you date someone who doesn't own a flububular? Flo 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 um, if they're willing to overlook my face motations. Oh, absolutely. Um, if they're a good person, I don't mind. Oh, really? Who do you think is smarter on average? Not you, freaking idiot. I'd say duck humans. Flattery always works. That's why I say things like, women are equal to men. <laughs> what are we at? Okay, two minutes in. We made it. Okay. <laughs> God, I gotta finish Honey Pup. Anyways, is it okay to smack your kids? Only when they're being bad. No, um, depends on their mutation. Someone straight up murder you if you try. Uh, uh, the right answer is probably no. I have my, you know, okay, alright, we'll get into this. So I was spanked as a kid, right? And I'll, I'll start by saying that since I was, like, strong-willed and lacked a considerable amount of mens rea growing up, it never really worked. But I, I am not the type to say definitively that I will absolutely never lay a hand on my children. Never in a way that would hurt them. Like, there's a reason it's spankings, just because, like, it doesn't... I mean, it, yeah, it hurts a little bit, but it, it just, like, stings a bit, and it's, like, the, the one place where there's no permanent damage, pretty much. I mean, it, it depends on how intense you're going, but, like, ten swats with a spoon, and, you know, it gets the point across without really doing damage. Anyways, uh, do you believe in mutant Santa? Who else brings deadly weapons? Um, there we go. Hey, the guy believes in Santa. I think he's a good guy now. Date someone out of your mutant genome? I hate children, so... No, I'm kidding. I love children. I want to be a father someday. But, um... I don't see mutant genome, actually. Um... Oh, come on. Was I, was I supposed to say the one that involved genitals? Uh... uh, uh why, would I, why would you ruin your pus-filled skin for that? Uh, ba da ba Helps distinguish cannibal tribes from vegan tribes. Um, sure, why not? So, I, I'm, I'm not gonna be the guy that, like, every time my kid does something wrong, they're gonna get a spanking, you know? But, I'm, I'm not gonna completely take the option of it off the table before I even know, kinda, how my kid learns things. Because if I've got a kid that only really learns if they're taught... Like, um, uh, my mom told me this one time. So my great-grandmother, she was, she was alive when I was alive, but she was already kind of gone in the head. So I didn't really, I didn't ever really get to know her. But my mom told me one time, one of the things that she said was, uh, 
Um, I'll say radiation hearted calcis. Darn, that was not a good move. Was that, uh, some people can be taught, but some people gotta learn. Or, no, it was like, some people can learn, but some people have to be taught. You know? And, and, uh, <laughs> well, uh, from another thing that my mom said about my great-grandmother was that uh, she was a very, she was a very, uh, you know, spank your kids when necessary kind of woman. <laughs> so, um, if I've, if I've got a, if I've got a kid that can learn, I'll let him learn. I'm not gonna, I'm not really gonna, like, beat a dead horse just to, just for the sake of punishment for a kid, you know? But if my kid has to be taught, I will teach them. I'm not gonna take that off the table. Um, but, you know, it can, that can come in a lot of forms. Any thoughts on breadcrumbs? Uh, I absolutely love breadcrumbs. Sprinkle that shit on everything, baby. I'll say, ah, oh, yes, breadcrumbs, you know. Um, do I like hip-hop? Tupac is still alive. Very nice. Um, I listen to good music. So, yeah, I love how this became the, the corporal punishment parenting episode. I guess I have to name it that now. Is your, is your partner's weight important to you? Um, now this is something I can pivot to. I kind of have an odd preference on this, where it's like, I don't, I, I think it's a proportion thing, and there's some part of me that it's not that I find larger girls specifically unattractive so much as I don't want to immediately become, like, the kind of white trash that has a fat wife. <laughs> um, but that it, that's not even so much important to me as, like, the person themselves. <laughs> Um, oh yes, more cushion to be, you know, yes, with extra, okay. I like how all of, both of the yes answers are like, yes, I want them to be heavier. <laughs> That's pretty good. Um, which isn't to say that I, I, I have never seen in my life people that are absolutely too skinny, but that is more of a, damn girl, are you anorexic? Is this something that I shouldn't be like sticking my finger into, you know? I don't mean sticking my finger into the woman. I mean, like, is this a pie I don't need to be sticking my finger into, you know? Like, putting your finger in that pie. It's not... I wasn't trying to be dirty there, but I, I definitely flubbed that. We're all gonna die soon anyway. Oh, you know, this guy's reasonable. Bioluminescence turn me on? Oh, absolutely. Nothing like sitting with my partner and seeing a light. Um... I love bioluminescence. If you were to eat duck, what seasoning would you use? I should say, uh, never eat duck. Um, absolutely salt and pepper. Salt and pepper on everything. What do you think of more duck's policies on world domination? Uh, more duck could suck my pet tuber. Uh, I'm not a politics guy, I just murder and steal. Um, He's alright. I don't like his policies on banning hip-hop, though. This guy likes hip-hop, actually, so that was good. Consider double morphing on the first date. Um, only after ecto-marriage. Uh, yeah, but it's not crucial. Cool, this guy's, this guy's so chill. Can you date someone really quiet? I prefer it when they're really quiet. In fact, I would prefer if they didn't say anything to me at all. Except for things like, uh, no, what are you doing in my house, you know, you know, foreplay stuff, just for funsies. Well, I'm a telepath, so technically, yes. Um, hum. It doesn't bother me. Yeah, this guy's lame. Enough questions, let's get into some foreplay. Here, have some money. This guy likes money, doesn't he? Yeah, he likes money. Here, have some money, man. I would like to make it rain on this fella. He's honestly a pretty chill dude, and he, he looks a lot nicer than Jimmy Longhands or whatever. So, uh, I guess this works out. Hey, hey. So this is, which is weird, considering we don't have cheeks. You'll have to prov prove to me that you can be a provider. Collect as many breadcrumbs as you can. abso freaking lootly dude. Oh, this is a... This is a freaking pathfinding game. 
I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this, because I definitely did not pick the right path here. Oh, darn. Jerry's obsessed with you. It doesn't look like it. He looks like he's ambivalent about me. Hmm. Well, anyways. I guess that's alright. You're too good at duck human suggest seduction. Oh my gosh, I'm so good at this game. We did it. We seduced the duck. I think we're gonna go back to the actual game on the next episode, but you know, this was a nice a nice turn. So, you know. Uh remember kiddos, beat your children and um Fat girls just have more to love, I guess is what I'll say. It's just more of you to love. Anyways. Yeah, till then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll spank you. Unless you're into that, in which case, send me an email. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure, why not? I'll end it on that. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.